this is from CM again. So she asked, why is seeing, seeking an identity forming such a gift? It is, see, it is a seeming process on the way towards realizing there is no separate person. Would that not be cause and effect? Is cause and effect just part of the dream? And as long as there is dreaming, it appears real, relevant, when actually there is no meaning, no cause and effect, and no separate identity. Yeah. That's beautiful, CM. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> what contradictions, eh? Yeah, there is no cause and effect. There is simply what's happening. And <clears throat> all cause and effect is an illusion of the mind. But in the apparent cause and effect, there seems to be this apparent path or journey. But the ultimate truth is that there was nobody and there was no process. There was no gift, there was no seeing. JT, one practical head question. How best to find people in person who share this message? Have you found it to be worthwhile to build a community like this? In San Francisco, we have a van Danta Society, join that. So Ananda Mayi is such a beautiful, 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 insanely beautiful woman. She would say, you know, surround yourself with this message and with people that are interested in God. So she would call it God. So people that are interested in this message, people that are seeking people that are talking about this message, you know, don't surround yourself with people that are talking about, you know, how to become a successful business person, like every, surround yourself completely by God, she would say. And she means, you know, like people that are interested in this subject, community, you know, when you're on downtime, you know, watching, listening, videos, movies, etc. So it's always in your mind, in your experience. So, and I think that's really beautiful. B, C. Lisa, what about the tendency to, uh, to the tendency to try to find completion through non-duality teachers? Just checking this is still all running. What about the tendency to try to find completion through non-duality teachers? In one way, this seems like a reflection of the universe's aim, the search for God. And in someone truly, if someone truly finds the guru in their teacher, off with their heads. But is this too a game of validating an illusory self? Or is it bhakti? I would say don't worry about that part. Just keep presenting yourself to this subject. The person is going to seek, and much better to seek in Bhakti and in Guru and this subject than it is to seek in alcohol and drugs and sex and drama. So if the seeking is going to appear, Seek that. And if that's validating the person, then that's much better than the other stuff validating the person. Yeah, just read this last comment and then we do five minutes of silence. CM. Yes. All paragraphs. Docs all the way up 
down and no direction at all because that requires space, which is only in the dream. There is no actual way to talk or write about this nothing. That which cannot be grasped it is so hard to say or ask anything about this because no one can actually say anything about nothing or non-duality without it appearing in duality. In a picture of Bob. Yeah. Yeah. That is a great comment to finish on. <laughs>